Google has just dropped a bombshell on the world of wearable tech, and it's powered by Gemini AI. Unveiled alongside a bold new Android XR platform, these futuristic glasses offer real-time translation, visual memory, object recognition, and contextual assistance, all built into a device that looks just like regular eyewear. This isn't another tech demo or lab prototype. It's a direct challenge to Apple Vision Pro in Meta's AR lineup, and Google's approach is different. Smaller, smarter, and made for the real world. With Project Astra's multimodal intelligence running in the background, Google's XR Vision is no longer theory, it's becoming reality. 100% of people watching this are going to have something to say. So smash that like button and drop your thoughts in the comments below. Let's talk. Glasses with Android XR are lightweight and designed for all day wear, even though they're packed with technology. Google's new XR glasses aren't just another attempt at smart eyewear. They're a complete reinvention of how we interact with the world. Powered by Gemini AI and built on a dedicated Android XR platform, these glasses combine real-time camera input, voice understanding, and spatial awareness to deliver experiences that feel almost telepathic. A camera and microphones give Gemini the ability to see and hear the world. Speakers let you listen to the AI, play music, or take calls. And an optional in-lens display privately shows you helpful information just when you need it. Unlike previous attempts like Google Glass or Snap Spectacles, this device doesn't just record or display, it thinks. Users can point to objects, ask questions, and get context-aware answers instantly. For example, look at a circuit board and say, what part is broken? Or stare at your keys and ask, where did I last leave these? The glasses recall recent visual memory and answer like a real-time assistant. This leap is possible thanks to Project Astra, Google's next-gen multimodal AI. It allows the glasses to see what you see, hear what you say, and respond in natural language with knowledge drawn from both real-time visuals and internal memory. It's like having a live Gemini agent whispering insights into your ear, but without the device ever getting in the way. Google isn't just adding AR overlays, it's embedding AI into the fabric of reality. While most XR hardware tries to impress with flashy graphics and virtual spaces, Google is aiming for something radically different, utility-first AI eyewear. These Gemini-powered glasses are designed to disappear into daily life, not stand out like sci-fi helmets. That's what makes them a real threat to Apple Vision Pro. Meta's Ray-Ban smart glasses and even Snap Spectacles. These glasses work with your phone, giving you access to your apps while keeping your hands free. All this makes glasses a natural form factor for AI. These glasses do what none of their competitors can. They understand your surroundings. Thanks to the multimodal capabilities of Project Astra, the glasses analyze visual input, track spoken queries, and provide smart responses instantly. Ask what kind of flower you're looking at, get a breakdown of nutrition facts from a food label, or receive a reminder when you forget your wallet, all with seamless AI assistance. What separates Google's approach is that it doesn't rely on bulky headsets or closed ecosystems. This is Android XR, an open platform backed by major hardware partners like Samsung and Qualcomm. That means developers can build apps, games, and tools tailored for AR use and those tools will run natively on the glasses. In addition, Gemini's memory and reasoning engine makes it more than just an input-output machine. It retains short-term memory, follows up on previous queries, and adapts to how you live. No camera indicators, no unnecessary filters, just real-time intelligence that helps you live smarter. Hey, everyone. Right now, you should be seeing exactly what I'm seeing through the lens of my Android XR glasses, like my delicious coffee over here and that text from Sharon that just came in. Let's see what he said. All right, it's definitely showtime, so I'm going to launch Gemini and get us going. Send Sharon a text that I'm getting started and silence my notifications, please. Okay, I've sent that message to him and muted all your notifications. Perfect. 
Oh, hey, Nishta. Hey, Dieter. Uh, I see the lights on on your glasses, so I think it's safe to say that we're live right now? Yes, we're officially on with the I.O. crew. Hey, everybody. It is pretty great to see I.O. from this angle. Nishta, you promised me I could get my own pair of Android XR glasses if I helped out back here, so uh, what do you say? Of course. Let's get coffee after this, and I'll bring you those glasses. Awesome. We'll see you then. Good luck. Thank you. As you all can see, there's a ton going on back and is that pro basketball player Giannis wearing our glasses? I love it. This plays out both of my hands for double high fives. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Let me keep showing you guys what these glasses can do. I've been curious about this photo wall all day. Like, what band is this and how are they connected to this place? Shows at Shoreline Amphitheater, which are often seen as homecoming shows for the band. Google isn't just building another device. It's laying the foundation for a new digital interface that doesn't live in your pocket or your hand. It lives in your vision. Behind Google's new smart glasses is a much bigger ambition, one that goes far beyond wearables. With the launch of Android XR, Google isn't just entering the AR race. It's redefining the battlefield. This new platform is built to power the entire future of spatial computing, with the glasses as just the first step in a much larger vision. Android XR isn't limited to one device. It's an open, modular system built to support a whole ecosystem of extended reality devices, from glasses to headsets and whatever comes next. And Google isn't going at it alone. It's partnering with Samsung and Qualcomm, combining Google's software, Samsung's sleek hardware, and Qualcomm's powerful XR chips. That collaboration is a direct challenge to Apple's tightly controlled Vision Pro stack. But what truly powers this next generation experience is Project Astra, the AI brain behind it all. Astra is more than voice input or visual search. It's a multimodal agent that sees through your camera, hears your voice, remembers past interactions, and responds intelligently. Ask it to help you fix a bike chain, translate a sign, or track an object in motion. It doesn't just answer, it understands context, learns over time, and helps in the moment. Hi, what was the name of the coffee shop on the cup I had earlier? Hmm, that might have been Bloom's giving. From what I can tell, it's a vibrant coffee shop on Castro Street. Great memory. Can you show me the photos of that cafe? I want to check out the vibe. Definitely. Do these photos from Maps help? Oh, I know that spot. It's a flower shop as well as a coffee shop, but it is downtown. Hmm, okay. Gemini, show me what it would take to walk here. Getting those directions now. It'll take you about an hour. Okay. I can get some steps in, and these heads up directions and a full 3D map should make it super easy. <laughs> Go ahead and send Dieter an invite for that cafe and get coffee at 3 p.m. today. This is where Google's decades of AI research meet the real world. The glasses you wear become the eyes and ears of Astra. And with Gemini models embedded, Astra offers reasoning, memory, and a personalized experience in real time. No need to touch a screen or open an app. The ultimate goal? To make text so intuitive, so ambient, that you forget it's even there. No pulling out your phone, no swiping through apps. Just look, speak, and respond. It's a user interface built into the world around you, powered by AI that understands it all. And that's what makes this more than just another gadget drop. Google is laying the foundation for a world where AI and computing vanish into reality itself, with Android XR and Gemini leading the charge. With the launch of Gemini-powered glasses and the Android XR platform, Google didn't just enter the AR race, it changed the rules. Instead of chasing headsets that simulate new worlds, Google is embedding AI into our world, using real-time perception, memory, and reasoning to enhance everyday life. I'll send out that invite now. Enjoy the coffee. As you saw, Gemini helped Nishta search what she sees. Remember details like the coffee, coffee cup book an event, even navigate, all without taking her phone out of her pocket.
I'm even wearing the glasses right now too. They're my, they're my personal teleprompter, and I have prescription lenses so I can see you all. Okay, Nishta, this is a big moment for glasses. Let's capture it. Yes, get ready for a quick photo, everyone, and let's bring out our star. Here comes Peter. All right, Gemini. Janice. <laughs> take a photo for me. <laughs> All right, Gemini, take a photo for me and add it to my favorites. These glasses don't need flashy holograms or giant displays. They offer something more valuable, intelligence that responds when you need it and fades into the background when you don't. Whether you're navigating a foreign city, troubleshooting a device, or simply asking, where did I leave my wallet? This tech listens, sees, and answers, naturally and in the moment. And that's what makes this so revolutionary. With Gemini and Project Astra, Google is building a layer of AI that lives in your vision not on your phone. It's proactive, contextual, and always learning. Combined with Android XR's open platform and hardware partnerships, this is more than a product launch. It's the beginning of a wearable AI ecosystem. We're not just witnessing new hardware. We're witnessing the transition from smartphones to smart site. Computing that doesn't demand attention, it just quietly helps. So now the big question, would you wear glasses that remember, translate, and guide you every day? 100% of people watching this have a take. Drop your thoughts in the comments. I'm reading and replying to the best ones. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell. Because this isn't the end of the AI revolution. It's just getting started. And you'll see the feed from both of our glasses back here. And so you can all follow along will show an English translation in real time. Okay? Let's give it a shot. Fingers crossed. Besiar pu. Hala mituni bebini. Par fai man. Par jomemishan as farsi be ingilisi. Google's Gemini XR glasses aren't just smart. They're the start of a whole new interface for daily life. AI is no longer in your pocket. It's in your vision. Would you wear them? Comment your thoughts. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more.